We'll be continuing with the men's races and we'll be having five quarterfinals for the men, 500 metres. It looks like we're just about ready to start. This is the third day of the Oval, Oval Intercontinental Invitational International event. Some of these skaters will be warming up for upcoming World Cup events later this season. And just introducing our skaters in the first quarter final. We're in coming number 278 from Canada, Jamie McDonald. 257 from Russia, Anastasia Sorkova. And number 270 from Poland, Patricia Malisuska. And the first 500 metres race is underway, four and a half laps of the track. Skaters vying for a position in the top two to qualify for the semi-finals. And it's a skater from Poland, Patricia Malasuska, currently out in front. And really stretching things out in second place is Sorkova of Russia. Jamie McDonald of Canada currently in third place, looking for a spot to overtake with just two laps to go in this 500 metre quarterfinal. And with the commanding lead, it's Patricia Malazuska of Poland. As they come around the final corner now, it is going to be Patricia Malakuska in first place, Jamie McDonald in second place. Those are our two qualifiers for the semi final, and Anastasia Sokova coming in third position. Introducing the skaters for our second quarterfinal. We're in coming number 274 from Canada, Kerry Morrison. 262 from Russia, Maria Oberina. 266 from Russia, Ekaterina Efremenkova. And from Canada, Alison Demaray, wearing coming number 280. And the second quarterfinal safely underway. Four skaters vying for position in the top two. Currently out in front is Kerry Morrison of Canada. In second place, Maria Aberina of Russia. A little bit of a gap before we see our third skater, Alison Demaray, also of Canada. Currently in fourth place is Efremenkova of Russia. And these front two skaters taking a bit of a lead. As they come around this time, they'll be hearing the bell signifying one lap to go. So two skaters to qualify for the semi-final. Come around the final corner. Unofficially, it's going to be a win for Kerry Morrison of Canada. In second place, Maria Aberina. Taking third is Alison Demaray and Afromenkova of Russia taking fourth position. Introducing the skaters for our third quarterfinal. Wearing helmet number 289 from Canada, Lydiane Cornea. 297 from Belgium, Hannah Desmet. 263 from Russia, 
Elizaveta Kuznetsova. And number 291 from Great Britain, Hannah Morrison. And this is our third quarter final for the ladies 500 meters. Top two to qualify for the semis. Out in front is Hannah Demet from Belgium. Currently in second place is Elisaveta Kuznetsova of Russia. Hannah Morrison of Great Britain currently in third place. She's got some work to do to try and qualify for the semifinals. Anything can happen in these short track races. Out in front is Hannah Desmet. She's start. She's spinning the lead from the gun. Coming around the final corner now. It looks like unofficially it will be a win for Hannah Desmet in second place. Kuznetsova. Third place was Hannah Morrison. And in fourth place, Lydian Cornea. And the final quarterfinal for the ladies. Ring helmet number 287 from Canada, Camille de Serres Rainville. 290 from Great Britain, Sam Morrison. 283 from Canada, Isabel Carrier. And 272 from Canada, Courtney Schmier. False start, skaters are allowed one false start. And away safely for the second time. Out in front is Camille de Serres Ranville of Canada. Currently in second place, Courtney Schmier, member of the Canadian team. The battle going on for third place between Isabel Carrier of Canada and Sam Morrison of Great Britain. Skaters looking for a spot in the top two to qualify for the semifinals. Following this race, we'll be immediately going into the men's quarterfinals and we'll be seeing five races for the men. And coming around the final corner, unofficially in first place, it will be, oh, very close between Renville of Canada and Courtney Schmier. Going to go, have to go to a photo finish to decide who gets first and second, but looks like both skaters will be progressing through to the semifinals. And moving to the men's side of the competition, five quarterfinal hits. Top two skaters from each race will be progressing to the semifinals, plus the next two fastest skaters. We're in coming number 294 from Belgium, Ward Petra. 279 from Canada, Kyle Hillis. 275 from Canada, Jacob McKenzie. 276 from Canada, Hayden Mayu. And 267 from Russia, Artem Dachech.
started out happy with the start, so we'll be starting again. And safely away, second time. It's going to be a mad scramble to the line for those top two positions. And some very close racing out in the lead. He's number 275, that's Jacob McKenzie. Currently in second place is Kyle Hillis. Only the top two skaters are short of a place in the semi-final. They'll also be taking the fastest two skaters from all of the races. So it looks like it's th between these three skaters who's going to qualify for the next round. As they come around the final corner, it's going to be uh, Jacob McKenzie in first place, followed by Carl Hillis in second, and in third place, Artyom Darkek of Russia. In race number two, wearing helmet number 284 from Norway, Einan Agdenstein. 281 from Canada, Keegan Christ. 265 from Russia, Daniel Eibog. And 295 from Belgium, Gert Jan Gormine. And the second of five quarterfinals for the men, 500 meters, is underway. Out in front goes Keegan Christ of Canada. And hot on his heels is Daniel Eibog of Russia. Only two to qualify from this race, unless there is a fastest third. So 500 meters is four and a half laps of the track. And up the inside goes Daniel Eibog, very close between Daniel Eibog and Keegan Christ. Looks like they will be safely through to the semifinals. Third quarterfinal, wearing helmet number 258 from Russia, Alexander Shulginov. Number 288 from Canada, Alfonso Umet. 292 from Belgium, Rhino Van Huren. And 286 from Canada, Aye Richards. In this case, it's allowed one false start. And a fast start there for Shulginov of Russia. Takes the pole position. Currently in second place is Alfonso Umet of Canada. Two Canadians in this race. The other Canadian is number 286, Aye Richards. 
He's currently in third position. Alexander Shulginov of Russia with a clear lead now in this men's 500 meter quarterfinal. Still Alfonso Umet in second and closing the gap, gap ever so slightly is Aya Richards of Canada. And officially in first place, it's going to be a win for Alexander Shulginov in second place. Alfonso Umet, followed by Aya Richards and Rhino Van Huren of Belgium in fourth. And the fourth quarter final for men. Wearing helmet number 282 from Canada, Carter Chambers. Number 269 from Russia, Denis Arepetian. Number 296 from Belgium, Stein Desme. And 264 from Russia, Alexandra Koval. So this is the four, fourth of five quarterfinals for men. Out into the lead goes Carter Chambers of Canada. Right behind him is Stein Dismet. Or rather, Denny Arapetian of Russia currently in second position. He makes a nice pass up the inside, sees the gap. They need two a short of a place in the semifinals. Other skaters looking for a fast race so that they can qualify. So unofficially coming around the final corner, it's going to be Denis Arapetian of Russia in first place. And in second place, Carter Chambers. Those are our unofficial qualifiers for the men's semifinals. And a final quarterfinal of the men's 500 meters. Wearing the helmet number 285 from Canada, Antoine Roy. 298 from Belgium, Jens Alme. 268 from Russia, Artem Denisov. And 271 from Canada, Jesse Slusser. The final quarterfinal is underway. Following this race, there'll be a flood break. Out in the lead is Antoine Roy of Canada. Currently in second place is Jens Alme of Belgium. Looking for a place to overtake is Russia's Artem Denisov, currently in third position. Oh, and two fallers there. Artem Denisov goes out with Jens Alme, so that leaves uh, an easy qualifying ground for these two skaters, Antoine Roy of Canada, unofficially in first place, and unofficially in second place will be Jesse Slusser. And that concludes this uh, session of races. There will now be an ice resurface. Stay tuned for the time of the resumption.
In the previous race, there was a penalty for skater number 268 from Russia, Artem Denisov, for impeding. And as a result, skater 298 from Belgium, Jens Alme, will be advanced. Once again, Artem Denisov, penalty for impeding. Jens Alme of Belgium will be advanced to the semifinals. Races will be resuming at 10.25. Once again, races will be resuming at 10.25 with the women's 500-meter semifinals.